Hello beautiful people! Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video tutorial we're going to learn how to make this classic high waist bikini bottom. Get a pen and paper and write down the material you will need. You're going to need swimwear fabric, swimwear lining, swimwear elastic, some scissors or to cutter, some pins and a thread. You need waistband, front, And back piece. I am using my own swimwear pattern. It is available to download on the link below. Let's get started. I have folded over the fabric right side or facing each other and I have just folded enough so that my pattern piece fit. Place the pattern on the fold lining, knit, cut front and back pieces. Do exactly the same for the swimwear fabric and cut one westband. You should have one swimwear fabric front back and one lining front and back one waistband on swimwear fabric start by pinning the crochet seam on swimwear fabric you want to make sure right side or facing together and make sure that your notch is aligned and pin now pin the side seam both sides do exactly the same for the lining. So the crotch seam about six millimeter. I'm using overlock, but you can always use a zigzag on your sewing machine. P 
paint the side seam, both side, and sew six millimeter. Make sure it is aligned. Now, do the same for the lining. Now we need to join the lining to the bikini bottom. Leave the lining and bikini bottom turn inside out and pin the crochet seam together and sew. Now do the same. Pin the side seam, both sides, and sew 6 mm. Make sure it is aligned. When you look inside your bikini bottom or turn inside out, you won't see any stitch on the inside. Now we need to sew around the waist seam and legs opening. It will make easier to attach the swimwear elastic, trust me. <laughs> Now you need your waistband piece, fold in half, pin and sew 6 mm. Fold the waistband 
lengthwise and so. Divide the waistband and the bikini waist into four and mark. Now we need to attach the waistband to the bikini bottom. Pin the waistband to the wrong side of the waist, matching the four divided mark. So on the waistband to the bikini bottom, waist seam. And so around. We need to attach the leg elastic, but before we can do that, we need to overlap the elastic 6mm using a wide zigzag stitch for both leg and opening. Like this. Do exactly the same way to the other leg elastic. Elastic inside the leggings opening and so right the edge. Fold in and pin the leg opening and then sew on top stitch with a neat zigzag stitch all the way around. Just a quick tip, make sure when you're doing your zigzag you don't need to stretch at the front, just at the back a little bit. 